Hi everyone. Let's talk about the new system that the department is bringing in to help us manage electronic information better. It's called Electronic Document and Records Management Solution. That needs an acronym for sure, so it's EDIMS. EDIMS is designed to drive consistent ways for employees to manage departmental information, regardless of where they work. With EDIMS, everyone will be creating, saving, storing and finding information in the same system. Branches and regions have been grouped in waves and will be onboarded to EDIMS in a phased approach. Module 1, Collaboration. Module 2, Information Lifecycle Management. Module 3, Preservation. Module 1 is underway now. Some branches are going through the onboarding process as we speak. The entire department is expected to be on board it to Module 1 by next fall. Questions? Comments? What's wrong with how we manage our information now? It works for us. It might work for us, but it's not helpful for the department. It's not all about us apparently. We are a big department and we need to take advantage of the information that we currently have, instead of reinventing the wheel. Today, we have no idea what the guy in another branch, or region, is doing or has done, that we can use. With EDIMS, our department's information will all be in one place. And we'll be able to collaborate on work better, too. All information in EDRMS. Seriously. What about Ben Pei? CSGC, my EMS, SAP and PeopleSoft, etc. Sorry, I should have been more clear. You are right, we are not going to replace those systems with EDIMS. What we are talking about is all information that is identified as, and structured, so, briefing notes, reports, correspondence, presentations, etc. So for us, in the future, we should expect to use EDRMS instead of a CDS and shared drives. So when does this move take place? For us in the Ontario region, we start early in next fiscal year, that's what they call Wave 4. There is a schedule on iService that shows when all branches and regions on board. Is this where I have to apply all of the IRBV, IREV, and transitory? I am thing that I learned as part of earlier training? Sort of. Those concepts are important. What is really important is to know what to keep and what not to keep. For information that needs to be kept, you're going to have to identify documents with the right names and descriptions. You're also going to have to tag documents to show what kind of document it is and who will see it. Why all that hassle with the naming and tagging? When we describe the document and give it identifiers, that's called metadata. And it is the metadata that helps us search for documents later, and it helps to tell us how long certain documents should be kept by the organization. It also helps to determine when we can actually get rid of the document, so that information doesn't pile up. Do we get training on the CDRMS before we onboard? Yes. It is very important that all employees are prepared and ready to move forward with this new system. In addition to meetings like this, there are learning materials on iService. You can find them in Managing Information in ESDC Learning Center. And there will be more training to come. For now, I suggest everyone go to iService and become familiar with what's there. Thanks for the information. Pun intended. Information. Hours to manage.